M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So here we are with the Yaesu FT1D. What a fantastic design. Dual band radio, VHF, UHF, C4FM, APRS, packed with functions. And when this radio came out, it was way ahead of its time. And uh, Yaesu did a fantastic job. So many functions that, that the battery did actually struggle to, you know, to keep this radio going for, for a nice, for a very long time, unfortunately. But... If you got the cradle charger and a spare battery, it wasn't a problem. And it could do APRS, had built-in GPS, very wideband coverage. And if we just look down briefly at the description here, 2 meter 70 dual band transceiver, C4FM. Oh, it's just a lovely design, snapshot function. So you can transmit photographs, messages, your location. You can track each other. You've got group mode. The, all these features are now incorporated in the FT2D, eventually the 3D, and now the 5D. And that really, the functionality of the radio is that is very similar. Yes, you get a color touch screen on the FT5, but pretty much the radio does the nuts and bolts of it. It does the same thing, if you ask me. You haven't got Bluetooth. I've had Bluetooth in, in my FT5. I never use it. It's just something I just don't use with my handheld. Uh, maybe others do. It's a very wide band. Look at this, 504 kilohertz to 999.900 uh, megahertz. It's got a broadcast radio, and I've set this up before. You can listen to the broadcast radio at the same time as the dual band, and it is a. It, there are two receivers in there, so you can hear. Uh, it does describe it here. Let's see if I can find it where they actually describe that. Here it is. VHF, VHF, UHF, UHF, VHF, and UHF. Now, APRS is on the B band, and I'm pretty sure if you use C4FM, it's on the A band. You can't use PDN mode, but you can use it with a hotspot. You can use the wire, you know, the WireZX C4FM system, but it's not the type where you can uh, register with WireZX PDN, and you need the FT2, 3, or 4 for that. Um, so it's, it does have an SD card for memory transfer. So what is, I'm going to, going to get one of these quite soon. We're going to give it a good thorough testing. I know it's an old radio, but but uh, I do like to delve deep into these kind of radios, and I, I'm looking forward to tinkering with it. And if you look, at, it actually has a, a band scope, DTMF, just looking, T, TX power. If you look at the front buttons, we've got reverse AF dual, beacon TX. Of course, it, it, it will keep, it will get um, APRS messages receive and transmit. Uh, and so much more, I mean, even as I remember using the LED, it's quite a big LED on it as a torch. So endless functions, two signal meters, five watt radio, and uh, I like it in black. But hey, so if you still got this, uh, dig it out. Let's have a little play with it. I know a lot of people, they hang on to their radios and don't really want to sell them. So bye for now. 7-3, thanks for watching my channel. Catch you on air. All the best.